Wait, Whoa! 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 Sunny glasses go? Where's Chris? Chris, where do Miss Sunny glasses go? Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, do Miss can't find them. But where do Sunny go? Oh, 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 oh! Are they behind you, Miss? Could, 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 could you help? Yes, yes, Chris. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh! That was, that was a really big way of rumors was writing. Do, 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 do any of rules out there with soaps? I don't miss this practicing, guys. There's not a whole lot of water about rumors right now, but he practicing. And uh, you, you got to have some surfing music while you're surfing. Uh, that, that's what that's what rumors were told. If we're surfing, we'll have surfing music. If we don't, then well, it's... Rumors doesn't know they didn't tell rumors. But hello, boys, and welcome to another super awesome story time in the summers. Because, well, it's summer. Uh, so so that's why. Um, you, you miss his, you miss still wearing his super cool Hawaii shirt that Chris made for him and his sunnies. But he'll take them off in just a minute. But, yeah, you miss here with another super cool story for you. Uh, that's, that's called, what's it, what's it, what's it called, what's it called? That sand castle contest. Oh, that sounds super cool and fun. So you do me, do me, well, build sand castle. Or we'll have Chris build sand castle for them. So they'll be big ones. And you can like go around inside and you know, like the different inside of it. That you must think that'd be super cool. Ones. Uh, but there's really not a beach near Chris and I. Uh, so, in the future, maybe. Uh, you must think best uh, really close to a beach, he thinks. So. Maybe if he ever visits his bestie, maybe she can take him to see Sand. That'd be cool. But now it's story time. So, Chris, can you remove no Miss Sunnies so I can read better? Pop up. Then goes. What? Let's just get into the book then, then. It's not super tall book. Like, look. Look, look. If no Miss, no Miss is on tiptoe, she's like his tallest book. That's, it's not what we pick ones. Uh. Wait a minute, Chris. Is this done by the same guy who wrote the Cookies book? Blah, 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 blah. Oh, that's super cool. It's, it's wrote by Cookies guy. Oh, that's super cool. Well, just to see what Cookies guy thinks about sandcastles. Matthew's father stood in the driveway and said, I think we are all ready to go. Let's make sure everything is here. Do we have the bicycles? Yes. Do we have the food? Yes. Do we have the boat? Yes. Do we have everything? What? We're talking about the stuff they got. They got like a boat and a TV and list and camping stuff and squirrels and a dartboard and... Wait, the, the squirrels are coming at all. Well, that's fun. Can you miss joints? No miss likes the beach. No, no miss like sand. But maybe there's maybe there's just not enough for them. No no miss well white separates. No miss meat or deer. Deer, how about deer? No miss meat or deer. Holy moly. No miss don't think they're safe for road. No miss not expert. No miss don't know how to drive. No miss don't think they're safe. Like, no more place so like that boat or the grill is just gonna go free. Why are they bringing spring water? They, they, there's gonna be water at the end. Those are ice mesquites. Ice mesquites are for the ice. That's not at the beach. That made no sense to do this. And is that a vacuum? Is that a vacuum? And they go, what, they're gonna suck up all the steam with the vacuum? That's so silly. No, yelled Matthew. No, said his dad. No, said Matthew. We don't have a dog. Dog, said his dad. We don't even know a dog. I know, said Matthew. Now would be a good time to get a dog. No dog, said his dad. Now do we have everything? No, yelled Matthew. We don't have my sandbox. Matthew, 
said his mom. We can't bring the sandbox, but the first place we can will have a nice beach. You have lots of sand to play with. Well, okay, Matthew said. So they drove and 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 drove. No, no, my sandbox is in there a bit. Until they came to a place to camp. Look at all oh, those stuff is so high. It's taller than everybody else's. Oh, they put their faces. Oh, that's fun. You may didn't know people could bring faces camping. Matthew jumped out of the van and ran to the beach. He came to a girl making a small sand castle and big sand dog. <gasps> they built in a sand dog? Well, that's fun. I wonder if anybody's building a sand hedgy. Because that would just be automatically super cool in Numa's book. She said, Hi, my name is Kalita, and I'm going to win the sand castle contest. Wow, said Matthew. I'm going to build a sand castle too. What can I win? You can win a battle full of ice cream, said Kalita. All right, said Matthew. I almost wants a bathtub full of ice cream. So Matthew made a house with doors and windows and a wharf. He dug out the inside of the house so it had rooms just like a real house. He made sand tables and chairs and beds. TV that had a sand show on it. What? Look at all the stuff he making. The bed and tables and the TV even works. So they got electricity on the beach. Numbers don't know they got electricity on the beach. Um, Numbers don't think so, but if the TV is working. And this is a battery powered one. But that must have like a Baquillion batteries to one. So Numbers don't know. Numbers don't know. Matthew was almost done. Kalita came over to look at his house. See, it had her sand dog on a leash. Nice sand house, said Kalita. Very, very nice sand dog, said Matthew. What? Is that a real dog? No, it's our sand dog. What? Is that pizza, pizza tower? Great, I think there's pizza tower in the background. That's impressive. I didn't know Pizza Tower was on beach. <gasps> Unless it's sand Pizza Tower. Oh. No one don't want to eat pizza made of sand, though. Sand Pizza Tower, that's okay. But regular pizza is made out of sand. No one don't know what's about that. That, that. that just sounds too gritty to eat. A judge came by and said, Get this house out of here. Who put this house on the beach? This is my sand house, said Matthew. I made it for the sand contest. Ha, huh, said the judge. I know a real house when I see one, and there are no real houses allowed on the beach. Oh, it does look very realistic. Humus has to get from there. But the Matthew made it out of sand. It's just a sand house. Then he went inside and sat in the sand chair and watched the sand show on TV. Another judge came by and said, Get this house out of here. Who we'll put this house on the beach? This is my sand house, said Matthew. I made it for the sand contest. Ha, said the judge. I know a real house when I see one. There are no real houses allowed on the beach. Well, it is a real house. The, the, Matthew made it all. Don't make him feel bad. He did a really good job. All right, Missy? He did a really good job. Don't you yell at him. You must come after you. Hmm. Just keep reading, Chris. She went into the bedroom and looked at the sand bed. Then went to the kitchen, opened the refrigerator, and looked at the sand apples and the sand celery and the sand corns of milk. Then she said, Little boy, You've got to get this house off the beach. This is my sand house, said Matthew, and I'm going to prove it. Ha! said the judges. Now, what was he going to do? So Matthew went outside and kicked the sand house right beside the door. 
and all turned back into an enormous pile of sand and fell on the judges. Help! yelled the judges. And everyone came running and dug them out. Who's your escort? One little squirrels. One! My goodness. Ooh, that's still extreme, Matthews, but no misunderstands. They didn't realize it was Santa's house, so... No misguesses. When the judges were finally out from the, under the sand, they yelled, Matthew wins! His sand house was so good that we thought it was a real house. Matthew wins! Everybody else, and they gave him a bathtub full of ice cream. Whoa! Bathtub full of ice cream. Whoa, look at all the flavors. There's like chocolate and vanilla and alphabet and goldfish and broccoli and strawberries. And wait. Why your broccoli ice cream? An alphabet. Numis Numi would skip those flavors, by the way. Numis skipped those flavors. But wow. Bathtub full of ice cream. Anyway, uh, Matthew started eating the ice cream. And he said to Kalita, Want to help me eat this? Yes, said Kalita. They were eating the ice cream, Matthew said. How come you didn't tell me about the about your dog is sand? I bet you would have one with a sand dog. Yeah, look at that dog. He's even holding the ice cream. Well, said Kalita, this is Sandy, my sand dog. And I'm going to take him camping and feed him ice cream every day. He's going to be my pet. And I'm never going to turn him back to sand. Wow, said Matthew. I wish I had thought that. Can you show me how to make one? No problem, said Kalita. I always the, the pizza towers fell too, and it it it, it that Eiffel Tower, and for miraculous. I don't think it's supposed to be in. No, no, me don't think. I thought how it was supposed to be leaning. It don't, it don't need a miraculous. Or is it not supposed to? And Matthew's mom and dad were so happy with Matthew's amazing sand dog that look at the dog! They're playing on the toot toot and doing wings and balancing balls and doing a clippy clappy thingy with his paw on his bow tie. Super classy sand dog, super classy. They so happy. They decided to take it camping. <gasps> and they bring in the sandbox with them too. It wait, why are they taking surfboard camping? Are are, are the waves in the in the woods? Can you go tree surfing? It can can you go tree surfing or do yourself in between trees or <gasps> do yourself on top of the trees. That would be interesting. Nice. Do I they bring in the kitchen stove? You already got the go why you bring kitchen stove to No must don't understand these people. No must don't understand. But at least they got a fun doggy now to take with them. That, that's what's important. That's what's important. The ends. Well it's that was a very interesting story time. So, we didn't realize that if we built stuff on the beach, that it could come alive and be so super realistic. Noom is going to have to try sometime whenever he go to beach. He's going to make like a whole village of sand heads. And they're all going to go marching around. Happy, happy time. Book, why did you do that? <gasps> It's a book trying to tell you not to reveal secrets. <gasps> I think book is trying to tell you not to reveal secrets at the end. Numis will keep secret as long as you. You gotta promise keep secret too, okay? That that way the book doesn't come after us, okay? Can you promise you miss, please? Please, decrease. Okay. Well, we're, we're sorry, we're sorry, Mister Book. We'll keep saying secret, secret, okay? So it's um. 
Do remember, keep saying secret secret. And you must hope you enjoyed story time today. And I'll see you next time when you need a good book for naps or seeps. Or just want to store a good book. Like if we're staying inside from being super it's hot outside. You misunderstand us. And he hopes that you enjoy. And you must see you next time. Bye.